Hey guys, this is Debbie with Best iPhone Game. Hope you guys are having a great day. Uh, tonight I want to share a new app with you. This one is not a game. It's not a utility. Well, I guess it could be utility. Uh, it's not a business app or anything like that, although I guess it could be used for those purposes. Actually, this is a travel app. And uh, the name of it, as you can see right there on the screen of my iPad, is called NYC, or New York City. So, yes, you can tell just from the name and from the iconic in image that you see there on the screen. This app is all about New York City. And this is a really, really wonderful app that has all sorts of information about uh, New York City and also Manhattan. So if you have a trip that you're going uh, to that location for any reason, then you definitely need to get this app and, and put it on your phone. And uh, for best use with this, also you need to make sure that you have internet access so that you know you can use all the geolocation uh, functions on your phone to find out you know where you're at where you're going to how to get there and all that sort of stuff so if you're not actually in New York City and you're using this app kind of like I am and you pull any kind of uh, searches on stuff like that it's probably just going to show you where you're at now it, it won't work you know like it was really intended to but if you're actually traveling and you're in that area then you are in for a treat because this app has loads and loads of information all about the city so let's go ahead and open it up and let me back up here where you can see it a little bit better there you go so you can see from that beautiful screen there New York City so this particular app has all sorts of information and if you look at it down here at the bottom you can see some of the things you can look at you can set up a profile here's your wall you can send out messages uh, you know shout outs you can send out messages here you know email and stuff like that you can check in you can check out the photo feed, there's videos, and, and you know, sign up as other users and, and all that. So there's just loads of information here. So this app, uh, like I've already uh, talked about briefly, it's integrated. It has the, uh, the geolocation feature. It uses that a lot. And so that's going to help you be able to use maps and get directions in, you know, in case you want to go to anything like a, a new hotel or a, some kind of attraction or some new dining place you know a new restaurant you want to check out or maybe you want to go to some bar or something like that or a Broadway show or whatever if you don't know where you're at and you're new to the city all that geolocation stuff is really really going to help you out here because this is when you really want to use it so for now let's just kind of go through and I'll show you just kind of what to expect in some of these windows we'll go ahead and look at them so first of all if you tap on my profile you can go ahead and sign in with your account now before you go on your trip if I were you go ahead and set all this up you know, sign in with your Twitter or Facebook account if you want to, or you can sign up and become a member and actually get a New York City account, and that'll help you find your information that much quicker, especially once you actually get there, uh, because when you're already there, you won't want to take the time to, to do all that. So go ahead and do it ahead of time. All right, so if we're looking at the wall, okay, so we can see pictures that other people have put on here for, you know, things they're seeing or, or things they're doing, you know, they're attending different bars or they're going to, uh, you know, see plays or, or uh, somewhere to eat or whatever. So you can see what some of the other people who are actually have this app loaded on their phones, what they're doing. And that's really cool. So if you want to uh, find out more information, you might want to meet up with some of these people. You can find out all the information here. So that's really cool. Okay, so let's back out. If you shout, then that's within your account. So make sure you you know sign up. I won't do that at this time because I'm just showing you real quickly what to do. But anyway, if you want to leave a message, same thing. Make sure you already have an account. You can sign in. You can send messages. Uh, users, you can see what some of the other users. Maybe you not might know some of these people, especially once you get your own account. You can actually see how they've they've set up. So for example, let's see. Well, since we're not signed in, we won't be able to check them out. But anyway, if you wanted to and you were signed in, then you could find out more information about them. Okay. Videos. Let's see what's in there. So these are some videos that are happening strictly in New York City. Uh, some things that are going on there. Um, and that's really cool. You can actually look through these. And if you see something that looks interesting to you, then you could just tap on it and watch it. So that's really neat. So for example, walking around New York. Well, if you tap on that video, then then you can watch and see 
of this person, and I'm not going to flip the thing at this time. But anyway, you can get the idea. You can see the video of, of what this person actually taped. Okay, photo feed. That sounds pretty much, I'm sure, exactly what, what you see and what you read as far as the photo feed. Well, here you go. Pictures that people have taken while they're in New York City or... Say, for example, you saw this one and you want to see it, just tap on it. And then you can see more information if you want to. You can kind of click through them here and see more information about some of the photos. Well, that's really pretty. Very nice. Okay. Or we can just back out of that all together. And you can see other, other things. So that was New York City. So this is like... Uh, Highlight here. Let's see what's in that. Oh, nice. So we got a lot more going on as far as like some actual nature pictures. All right, some actual trees and stuff. <laughs> All right. Uh, you can see this trees. Here we go. Things happening on the streets. How about the subway? That's probably pretty, pretty crazy. Let's see what's going on in there. Street, uh, subway pictures here. Oh, nice. So anyway, you get the idea. You can look at the pictures there, and uh, if you wanted to uh, check in and maybe check out some of these other things that are happening, like uh, arts and entertainment or Broadway. Uh, food, whatever, you can actually click on one of those to see what's going on. Or you can get maps and say this is where I'm at now. So anyway, <laughs> that's not going to help us any go into New York City. But anyway, that gives you a really basic idea of what to expect in this app. So if you're figuring about going to New York City, especially if you don't, you know, if you don't live there, this would be a perfect app to help you. And if you just moved there, this could be a really great help to you also. Um, it has information, you know, you can get, find that information about, you know, the local attractions or places to eat, shopping, nightlife, uh, Broadway, you know, if you want to do sightseeing, you know, find out your locations and directions, uh, all the events that are happening in New York, musicals, you know, things happening in the park, Central Park, um, what else? Uh, the, the, uh, if you're into fashion, you can check out the fashion area. There, and there's just so much information. Tribeca, information on Soho, information on Times Square and Fifth Avenue, and, and just all of that. There's just loads of information in here. Just way too much to be able to go over in one video. So try it out for yourself. Again, the name of the app is called NYC, as you can see right up here. Very easy to remember. The perfect name for it. Give it a try. See what you think. And I highly encourage you to get it for yourself. And the price is right. Right now it's free. So I give this, you know, my highest recommendation. Go get it for yourself if you're even thinking about you may want to go to New York City or that you have a trip already planned. You will enjoy it, and it's just a great app to use. So, again, this is Debbie with Best iPhone Games. You guys have a great day. Thanks a lot.